Imagine creating fun and heartwarming cartoon animation videos like this without spending a time on expensive software, without having any animation skills, and all in just a few simple steps. Yep, it is totally possible. Did you know kids absolutely love these types of videos? They watch them again and again, and YouTube's algorithm loves that. It automatically pushes them to millions of views. Let me give you a quick preview of the animation I made using nothing but AI. One sunny day, a boy named Jamie was playing near the woods. He saw a shiny butterfly and followed it deep into the trees. Suddenly, he found himself in a magical forest. The trees sparkled, the flowers sang, and in the middle of a clearing, Jamie saw a unicorn lying on the grass. The unicorn looked sad. My name is Starhorn, said the unicorn. Someone stole my horn. Without it, the forest is dying. Jamie felt sorry for Starhorn. I'll help you find your horn, he said. First, and that is just a sneak peek. Now, what if I told you that you can start your whole faceless YouTube channel, create trendy cartoon animations for free using AI and potentially earn passive income without any complicated software or drawing skills? In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to do that in four simple steps. And the best part, you only need to make only one video and you can post it on YouTube, TikTok, and Instagram to reach a massive audience. So, if you're ready to let AI be your personal animation studio, let's jump right in. Writing a story with ChatGPT Every great animation starts with a great story. But don't worry, you don't need to be a writer. We are going to use ChatGPT to come up with a simple, engaging, kid-friendly script that holds attention from start to finish. Here is the idea I gave ChatGPT. You can do the same, just describe your idea briefly, okay? Now watch this. ChatGPT is generating a beautiful story in real time, right before our eyes. So the script is a bit long. For the purpose of this tutorial, I want to make it shorter. So I will give ChatGPT to summarize the story into 300 words. And that is what I've written here. And in just seconds, it's created a full 300 word story based on that simple idea. Next, we need image prompt to match the story. I ask ChatGPT to generate 12 prompts. And I also included details like the character's age, hair color, eye color, facial features, clothes, and shoes to keep everything consistent across the scenes. Okay? But I noticed something important. The first prompt had all the character details, but some of the other didn't. That could cause inconsistencies in the visual. So I told ChatGPT to rewrite all the prompt and include those missing character traits. Boom! It's updated every single one with complete details. Now that we have detailed prompt from each scene, so I gave ChatGPT one more command. Arrange the story alongside each image prompt to make it ready for voiceover. So just copy the story from up here, paste it after the command, and click Submit. Within seconds, ChatGPT perfectly arranged the story with its matching prompts. How cool is this? Now we know exactly what to narrate in each scene. You can see AI is literally doing all the heavy lifting for us. Now that leads us to the next stage, turning prompts into images, text to images. Now, next, it's time to turn this prompt into visuals. So I'm using two powerful and two free AI tools for this. Piklume and ideogram.ai. So let's start with Piklume. Log in with your Google for free. After logging in, click create. Choose the Flux One model and set the dimension to 9 to 16. This is perfect for social media. Then copy the first prompt and paste it into Piklume. Okay? Then Copy the first prompt from ChatGPT and paste it the boss here and generate the image. So the result here was ultra realistic, which looked cool, 
but we need a cartoon star so i added three deep pizza star to the end of the prompt and i tried again so this time this is perfect for cartoon star result so download it into your device so we need to repeat this process copy the prompt from chat gpt and paste the prompt here then generate two image variations okay so now let's try and download into your device and that is it now let's try this with ideogram ai keep in mind you only get five free generation per day here so i pasted the same prompt i added 3d pizza style so you select 9 by 16 ratio set it to realistic mode and click generate just like piccolo man ideogram ai created stunning visuals so i will repeat this for all my prompts using both tools i'll tweak and regenerate if needed until i am happy with the result once all the images are ready so here is the preview of what i got are not this incredible now let's bring these images to life you can use these two powerful image to video tools you can use Halo AI and Vidu AI. First up, let's try Halo AI. I searched for it on Google. Click the first link and logged in. So you get 100 free credits daily here. So after logging in, you hit try now, then choose image to video. So upload your first image. So paste the related prompts. I will go to ChatGPT and copy the related prompt of that image. Then I select I2V01 model. So set the quantity to one. This is the catch. You can also pick camera movement here, which is cool. And you click generate. So it takes a few moments, but it works even if you leave the page. You can queue up to three tags at once. Next. I uploaded the second image and repeat the process. For more videos, you can either use multiple accounts or go for the paid plan. Now let's test video AI. So we are using same steps. Google it, go to Google, click the first link, hit try now and upload your first image. Paste the matching prompt. And click generate video ai is super fast it gave me the animation in seconds honestly both are impressive i will use them to animate all my images scene by scene now for the voiceover i'm using 11 laps one of the most advanced ai test to speech tools so you will get 10,000 free characters and a huge selection of voice actors so click voices here, then library and pick a voice from the narration and story category. I will choose one that fits the tone of my story perfectly. So you click add. Now I will paste the script in batches. So we want to click generate. So 11 lab has generated voice for us and we download the voiceover. I will repeat this for every scene. Now it's time to put everything together. I'm using CapCut. It is free, easy to use and perfect for this kind of editing. I have already organized all the clips by scene to speed up the process. First, I imported all the clips and dragged them into the timeline. Then I crop each one to make the main character stand out more. So I'll be fast forwarding this place to save time. So I imported all the voiceover and sang them with the visuals. So if any gaps appear, I cut and trim the audio to make it smooth. Sometimes a video clip might be too short. How do you fix that? To fix that, I had an extra image or slow down the clip slightly. Problem solved. Next, I added transition between each scene for a smooth flow. So I noticed we need sound effects here. So how do you get sound effects? You can go to Pissabre sound effects and to add realism. I downloaded a broad sound 
and added them right where it got to the forest. So finally, we need audio for our story. So I went to YouTube audio library. That is where you can find copyrighted free background music. So I went to YouTube audio library and found a beautiful background music track. So I ported it, trim it, and adjust the volume to complement the narration. Finally, everything is in place. Voice, visuals, music, and sound effect. Now, I want to export the final video in 1080p for top quality. And that is it. You've now seen how to go from a simple idea to a fully animated cartoon video using nothing but free AI tools. So if you found this guide helpful, give it a thumbs up. Share it with your friends and hit that subscribe button. Your support keeps us going and we've got more amazing content coming your way. So here is a final video. Hope it inspires you to start creating your own. Meet you in the next one. One sunny day, a boy named Jamie was playing near the woods. He saw a shiny butterfly and followed it deep into the trees. Suddenly, he found himself in a magical forest. The trees sparkled, the flowers sang, and in the middle of a clearing, Jamie saw a unicorn lying on the grass. The unicorn looked sad. My name is Starhorn, said the unicorn. Someone stole my horn. Without it, the forest is dying. Jamie felt sorry for Starhorn. I'll help you find your horn, he said. First, they went to a glowing cave. The door had a riddle. What belongs to you but others use it more? Jamie thought and said, my name. The cave opened. Inside, they found a glowing piece of the horn. Next, they walked through a forest where the trees whispered. One tree was crying. Jamie hugged it and sang a song. The tree felt better and gave them another piece of the horn. Then they came to a tricky path with moving stones. Jamie closed his eyes and trusted his heart. Step by step, they crossed safely. Finally, they saw the last horn piece, but a baby fox was stuck nearby, hurt and scared. Jamie helped the fox before picking up the horn. A bright light filled the forest. The horn flew to Starhorn's head and sparkled. The trees danced and flowers laughed again. Thank you, Jamie, said Starhorn. You saved the forest with your kindness. Jamie smiled and waved goodbye.